Well, good day everybody. Welcome to the Bible in a Year 2021. We are on day 364. 364, the end is in sight and we are reading through Revelations 12 to 18. Verses 12 to 18. You know, quite often we, we talk about... Um, We've read the book, we know how it ends. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what we're doing right now. Uh, we're reading this through. And even if you don't understand um, all the, the references, all the names, all the stuff that's going on, because it's a lot. It's a lot. There's a lot of imagery and everything. You, you get the big picture. You, 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 get, you get to understand um, that the, the world is going to go through a very um, tough time. And... and um, uh, the the Lord is revealing His power as He did to the Egyptians, as He did to the world at that time. He's revealing who He is as the Creator, as the Judge. Uh, he's revealing who He is as the Compassionate One. Uh, he just wants people to turn to Him. He wants them to see Him in all these things and turn to Him so that they will be saved. That's that's what He wants. But at the same time, His judgment is coming down upon those who don't turn down on, on, on the wicked, those who re, remain stubborn in the rebellion and their idol worship and, and their hatred and their murder and, and all those things. It's, um, it's hard. It's hard for us to read. But did you notice something? In, in, all, of our, in all of our reading, in all of our, our study, we have... Um, we have measured things according to years, according to decades, according to uh, long periods of time, centuries. Uh, you know, we have the Israelites in the desert for 40 years. It took them um, several generations to actually possess um, all the land that was that was had been given to them, set aside for them. Um, even even Jesus' ministry uh, was was three years, about three years, from, from what we understand. Uh, so, like these things are all being measured in in years and, and, and decades and centuries and generations. But what we find here in Revelation is everything is being measured in days. It's in days, and. We know the Bible tells us that uh, a day is like a thousand years and a thousand years like a day to the Lord. Um, the time just doesn't have that same reference because he's outside. He created time, but he's outside of time. And yeah, that's we we'll get into the science fiction thinking, right? About timelines and, and, and time travel, all that sort of That's not. Uh, it, it's just that. Um, there was a certain place where he inserted himself into our history in Bethlehem on, on that, that, that day to Mary and, and, and Joseph entered into our, our timeline. Um, but here in, in Revelation, we see everything that is happening being it's just one after another bang 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 it's so quick it's so quick and that's what he warned us he he said w when he returns it will be he it'll be like a thief in the night there'll be there'll be no warning and it's going to be quick and everything's going to be quick uh paul uh says that in a, in a twinkling of an eye we'll all be changed um it, it, it everything will be so fast so as we read through this it's one thing after another after another after another and unfortunately uh, people just choose to, to harden their hearts that's what we're being told here they choose to harden their hearts they don't turn to the lord they don't turn to him um and 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 receive salvation and and be rescued from all of this instead they they harden their hearts and, and they face they face the uh the judgment that it is coming to all those who remain in rebellion to the Lord. Because um, he is a just God. He is a just God. We have to remember that. And uh, so we know the day is approaching. We know, we, we know um, things that used to take a hundred years uh, just take a few years now things that used to take a few years just takes a few months things that used to take a few months a few days now in our history things change so quickly in, in our history we know that as we sit here in this pandemic 
you know, I, going on to two years in, in a pandemic. Um, and regardless of what you want to think about that, look at the effects that it has had on, on the world. It's, it's been tremendous. Um, so understand that when this comes, there's not going to be a lot of time for thinking. You need to be right with the Lord. You need to be faithful. You need to be on top of things. You need to be serving Him. That's what's important. And we need to continue to bear witness to the world around us of hope, of joy, of peace, contentment that we have in Christ. Okay, so you guys be blessed. We'll meet tomorrow for the last day of the Bible in the year 2021. God bless.